This is UCLH at Westmoreland Street. You may be asked to come here for an outpatient appointment. When you arrive, the main reception will help direct you to where you need to go. Please ask if you'd like someone to escort you. Bring your appointment letter with you and show it to the receptionist. If you go just round here to the right hand side to the waiting area, take a seat in there and one of the nurses will call you. You'll be asked to wait in the waiting area. The nurse will call out your name when they're ready for you and you'll go to the consultation room. Good morning, sir. I'm one of the nurses in the clinic. Uh, my name's Joanne. My name's Musa, and I got my, my passport. Your hospital passport can give nurses and doctors valuable information about how best to support you and to communicate with you. If I'm talking too fast, stop me. And if I say things that you don't understand, ask me and I'll explain it to you. Okay. The doctors asked me to do th a few tests on you, so we're going to do your blood pressure first. Are you happy with that? I'm happy with that. Do you have any questions at the moment? Another. The nurse will want to do some tests, like taking your blood pressure. You'll also be asked to do a flow rate test in the flow rate room. This is our flow rate room. You will be asked to urinate in this toilet and catch some urine in this pot. Yeah, that's clear. Have you understood? Any questions? No question, I understand clear. After you have done these tests, you will then go back to the waiting room. Musa Khan, please. Your doctor will call your name when he's ready to see you. The doctor will ask you some questions, and you can ask the doctor any oh, questions you, ask, you might Musa. have. I, I'm okay. You can show the doctor your hospital passport. My name is Mr. Hamid. I'm one of the urology doctors and your doctor has asked me to see you because you're having some trouble with your waterworks. When you go to the toilet, is the flow not as good as it used to be? No. How long this has been going on for? And quite a while. Quite a while, yeah. 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 The doctor might also want to carry out a physical examination. If at any point you feel pain, you are anxious, just tell me and I'll stop. Following your appointment with the doctor, you might need to have a bladder scan. Your doctor might also ask you to have a procedure known as a flexible cystoscopy. You'll need to come back on a different day for this. I'm going to talk to you about the procedure you're going to have, which you uh, may understand is due to the fact that you've had some blood in your urine. It involves a very fine telescope going down the water passage into the bladder. It's done under a local anaesthetic, which will help to numb the area. It is a little bit uncomfortable, a little bit painful but it gives us information very quickly. So I'll be able to hopefully tell you maybe the cause of why you have blood in your urine. You might also be asked to have a blood test. You may need to make a new appointment before you leave or a letter will be sent to you in the post.